Hey everyone, welcome back to Placement Season. Hi, I'm Saurabh Naik. If you are applying to Accenture or got shortlisted for the role of Package App Development Associate, then this video is for you. So Accenture is hiring for the role of Packaged App Development Associate, the batch of 2024. BB Tech, MEM Tech students can easily apply for this role. In the next few minutes, I'll explain about this role's job description. What does a Package App Development Associate actually do? What skills do you need to get shortlisted? the eligibility criteria and finally the interview tip so make sure you watch the video till the end hit that like button if you found this video helpful the term package app development associate might sound confusing at first but it's simple this role focuses on working with enterprise applications also called as package software like sap oracle salesforce workday microsoft dynamics your role is to customize and implement these apps based on the client's need. That means you won't be doing some hardcore development all the time. Sometimes it's configuration, scripting or integration task. So what does a day look like in this role? Design, build, test, assemble, support and configure application using business requirement. Understand business drivers that will impact performance and deliver software to those expectations. Bake technology trends into solutions, participate in development of automation solutions and support extended to customer through voice interaction, email, chat. Talking about the skill set, what Accenture requires in a package app development associate candidate, basic programming in Java, Python and C, SQL knowledge, understanding of SDLC, good communication and teamwork and finally a learning mindset. And here's a tip, even if you don't know tools like SAP or Salesforce, no worries. Accenture provides training during onboarding. Talking about the salary, salary they haven't mentioned over here. Earlier they used to provide a CTC of 4.5 LPA to package app development associate, but now they haven't mentioned. So we don't know what's the current status of the CTC. Now let's talk about the eligibility criteria. Any engineering stream of BB Tech, MEM Tech or MCA. If you are from MSc, then the field should be CSIT, Computer Application, Data Science, Computer Science and Applications. The pass out batch is still 2024. So if you are 2022, 2023, 2024, you are eligible for this role. No active backlogs during onboarding. The candidate should not have any gap in his academics. That's it. These are some basic eligibility criteria from Accenture. Now let's talk about the recruitment process. The recruitment process is as sorted as simple. You need to upload your resume, apply now and fill up your personal details, academic details, done. You will get a confirmation mail from Accenture. You will get a mock assessment link on your mail. Mock assessment is basically a demo test in order to check your laptop compatibility, your internet connectivity, etc. Then comes the main assessment, the cognitive and technical assessment. That is the round one. You will get 90 minutes to complete this assessment. English ability, critical thinking and problem solving, abstract reasoning, technical questions includes common application and MS Office, pseudo code, fundamentals of networking, security and cloud. So these are the topics you need to prepare thoroughly. You can watch YouTube videos, you mock test on various websites, provide tests on these topics and you can improve your knowledge. This is the elimination round and if you are not able to clear it, you are just opt out of the recruitment process. After this round, just wait for 5 to 10 minutes because uh, the coding assessment will commence immediately after this assessment. If you clear this assessment, you will be moved to the second assessment that is a coding assessment. You will get two questions that must be solved using one of the following languages like C, C++, .NET, Java, Python. You choose one of this language and complete the two questions with all the test cases passed. Then third comes the communication assessment, which will be held two to three days after this coding assessment. The duration of this communication assessment is approximately 30 minutes. You will receive a separate email with timelines and login details to participate in this assessment. It basically checks your sentence mastery, vocabulary, fluency and pronunciation. After this, you will be forwarded to the interview process. There is only one interview that is HR plus technical. That's it. You can watch multiple videos on YouTube for this role where the candidates have uh, shared their experience about the interviews. Here are some quick interview tips if you get selected. Revise your basics of SQL, DBMS and 
Oops, practice simple codings like strings, arrays, pattern. Work on your communication. So that was a complete breakdown of package app development associate at Accenture. Let me know in the comments if you have your interviews scheduled or you want expected interview questions in the next video. If this video helped you, do give it a thumbs up, share with your friends and subscribe for more job updates, resume tips and placement advice. See you guys in the next video with a new company. Till then, take care.